Merci, Monsieur le Président. Thank you. President, higher representative, the EU-China summit has unfortunately been a dialogue of the deaf. Beijing refuses to take the hand offered by Brussels to work together to find a solution and bring pressure to bear on Putin to stop this barbarity. Europe came with its questions and China with its answers. This China, which boasts of being a peaceful state and having a defensive strategic culture rather than aggressive one, shall one day be held to account by future generations of Chinese for its support for Putin. As for us in the EU, the unbearable images from Bucha should force us to assess the extent of our errors in the past. In recent years, we've not been firm enough with Russia. That's why it's so important today to be firm with China and its aggression towards Taiwan, as well as its human rights violations in Hong Kong, Tibet and its monstrous behaviour towards the Uyghurs. Faced with this new barbarity in Bucha, I expect our EU representatives to keep up the pressure on Beijing for them to stop supporting Putin's war and leave Taiwan alone. Thank you. Uh, next speaker is Ms. Isabella Wiesler-Lima uh, for one and a half minute. Uh, floor is yours.